Hey, it's Square Guy. Welcome back to the Talos Principle. And uh, I discovered that this game has third person mode available. So I'm going to be playing third person mode because I think I'll be able to have a lot less motion sickness with third person because that's usually how it goes with me in these games. So we are behind this robot now and we are in this new place um, where we left off last time. So I actually have a, a backlog already for the past couple episodes, but I am enjoying this one so much, it looks like I'm supposed to bring- this is what the flashing red thing is, I need a tool. I'm enjoying this game so much, and I have some free time that I thought, you know what? Why not build up more of a backlog? So we're back here in this game. Now it does look a little bit weird seeing this robot guy jog around, but maybe we'll get used to it. Um, yeah, so in, in editing this morning, episode two, I realized that there was a question that said, what is a person? And I chose a citizen. That was a really bad choice because it implies that a government can just say, you are not a citizen and therefore you are not a person, which is not something we want in our definition. Uh, so the other option that I noticed was a rational animal, which is also not perfect, to my views because I want something that can include AI and aliens and stuff uh, but there just wasn't an option for all that stuff so hopefully uh, hope of, hopefully we can I don't have the thing for this um, you know I hopefully that that's the direction that this game is going, is going to get us to reconsider all those options and say, perhaps it's something even more inclusive than rational animal and stuff like that. Or uh, a human or a citizen. We'll see. I'm just running around uh, looking for puzzles, I guess. I don't like that sound every once in a while, that I just, I just don't like it. Did I try going in here? Yeah. Alright, going to the left. So, I searched in, last time a lot for... Uh, are any of these the right ones? Do I have anything? Do I need to go back to a different world? Can I do any of these puzzles? Hmm. Or was that maybe difficulty? It looks like I can just hop down there, but I think this is the edge of the of this realm. So the way that I think this story is gonna go at this point, and uh, don't tell me in the comments, because uh, I would love to be surprised, but it looks like we are in a simulation and the people at Ian or Jeff or whatever it's called are uh, are Currently running an experiment. This is not a this is not a far future thing. It's a present day essentially and um, As present day and this is a simulation where it's all set up to look like it's the far future and then this is either uh, an artificial consciousness that they created, or it's a person who's undergone voluntary amnesia. So, uh, we'll see when the story ho uh, plays out, I hope. I get surprised. Um, yeah. The female voice that speaks from the abnormalities, it speaks with a different tone to the other wretches in this place. Did I try going in here? Yeah. I don't think... Yeah, there's these things. I think I need to do something. I might not be able to do this one. I might not be able to do this world yet. Huh. Maybe I can, but let's go back to world three. Uh, oh yeah, and in the, in the editing, I looked in world two and it is... <laughs> it is uh, pretty clear. Um, where I found where the star is right away. 
It is real close. I'm actually, I, I actually want to look at that again real quick. So, back in number two. I spent like 15 minutes looking for this star. It's literally right over here. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Let's see, if we want to, we want to shoot a thing, uh, uh, a thing at here, maybe from inside another puzzle. Is there anywhere that we could like, no holes in the walls? We like go above the wall. I don't know. It, it 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 does feel like we need a like if I aimed it up here, would that? I don't think that would hit it, right? It does feel like we need to bring one of those things out here in order to get the star. So at least I know where it is now. <laughs> the 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 power of uh, playback. What's over on the other side in the same place? Nothing. Hello. No button to to listen in or anything. All right, time to go back. Check out World Three. Ugh, that's so weird. What? Go! I don't know, I don't understand. Is that a glitch? Was it patched out? Alright, we're in World 3. Actually, I saw one of these in the World 1, I think, that I didn't get. Or maybe World 2. Why isn't it reading? List archive sections and it automatically chose list. All right, let's read some stuff. AI feedback. We keep discussing what an artificial intelligence would mean to us and how it would change our understanding of the world. That's a great topic and I think we've covered it extensively. What we've barely mentioned though is the other side of the coin. I mean, our lives would still be what they were before, AI or no AI. The question I think we should discuss, even if it's all completely hypothetical, is the perspective of the artificial intelligence itself. What would it be like to be that creature, to suddenly come into being, created by others as an experiment? To have all the information about yourself, to know exactly how you function? What would you think about the world? Would you see meaning? Beauty? How would you judge humanity? Where would you see yourself fitting into the grand scheme of things? I think we should try to put ourselves into the shoes of such a being. Dear Alexandra, thank you for your feedback, but this is a philosophy course, not science fiction. That's why I almost gave up on my studies. Jeez, that, what, a, what an awful professor, refusing to think of the big questions. We're blessed to have so many people contributing to this project, but we've got to make sure everyone is on the same page. Please refer to the following people. Alexandra Drennan, Project Lead AI Module. Nadia Sarabi. Uh, by the way, good science fiction is also philosophy fiction. <laughs> Nadia Sarabi, Rob McLean, Trevor Donovan, George Jameson. I'm not, I don't understand any of these uh, positions except lead. Alan Jameson, Bob Rakowski. We're gonna rem we're gonna run into these names a lot, aren't we? Rajia Brickmont. Aurora Calvin, Omar Garib, probably Omar, someone landing, maintenance module, God landing, Elohim landing, I don't know, J.E. Harrison, Frank Ngatai, Jared V. Shimlev, Sun Wei Yang, Talos unit, is that me? Am I... This Sunwei Yang, though di not directly part of our project, the archive team is sharing both physical and digital space with us. If there are any technical issues to resolve, please contract contact their project lead, Arkady Chernyshevsky. Chernyshevsky. Don't worry, he's nice. So now, 
little bit of evidence leaning toward the hypothesis that I am, in fact, a human who has undergone voluntary amnesia and is in a simulation. Stratton of Stadgeria. Is that this world? Oh no, it's a person. Stratton of Stagiria was a Greek materialist philosopher associated with the Peripathetic School. An admirer of Aristotle, he was a proponent of empiricism and a fierce critic of the philosophy that placed belief before observable truths. Though unpopular with many of his peers for his often acerbic personal manner, his commentaries on Aristotle were considered an important work. Much of his writing was lost in the destruction of the Library of Alexandria. Sounds like if this person had got the attention instead of Aristotle, we might have had science earlier. New texts added to journal. Cool. So, this one has a star. It is two stars. They're near the T and the red L. Well, let's go walk around and see what we find. I'm actually not really liking this over the shoulder so much. I'm going to try putting... I'm going to put it back to first person. Um, maybe narrow this field of view a little. Oops. Darn it. Alright, I think this might be better. I think the, the narrowed field of view might be a little better. An escalating problem. There's a thing up there. Can I pick it up from up there? Here, those who are worthy may seek the counsel of my blessed messengers. But their wisdom shall not be given easily, for your accomplishments must be your own. Is this, uh, is this hints? Ah. I know how the this works. The counsel of my blessed messengers must be earned. You got answers, I need them. Let's come to some arrangement. <laughs> that's this my username, my Steam username. Um version 99.110.9. No messenger will aid you until you have discovered their resting place. Return here to seek their counsel. Autoresponder. Neat. So some collecting collectibles. Yay! I love collectibles. Let's see, we've got... What is the purpose of this? Ugh. Bouncy wall. That didn't do well for my motion sickness. Alright. What's the reason to... Oh, I want to get the... I want to get this thing in there. That's what it is. Run over here! Alright. Can I take it? Yes, I can. Nice. Am I too close? No, I'm fine. Let's get you back there. <coughs> bye bye. Oh, let's go in here. All right, I can put it back up here. I can open it up again. Oh, no, only if I can get it up here. So I might actually be able to put this close enough to get it. Let's try. I put it right here. Huh. Let's see if I can pick it up. Ha! Now I'm back here, and I have the single one jammer. And, uh, I don't know if I can get it back, but that's okay. Alright, now it's time to go. I can drop it. I want... There's a gate. The gate is locked. Alright, we'll find a way to open the gate. 
And no need to drop it because I can just walk off. Alright, where are we going? Right here. And this, these gates are tall so I can't come in and jam these guys. This is like a Ocarina of Time thing with the boulders rolling around, but instead they're bombs. Okay, I just walk in and get the keys. <laughs> a bunch of keys or just one key? Which way are you coming? This way? What's back around here? Anything? Any reason to come back here? Gotta check. Go faster. You dumb bomb. <laughs> That's one thing about this. No, it's 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 this is 100% preference. But I like there to be secrets to be found if you like go behind places. I like there to be collectibles. I'm a search through every corner, find all the collectibles kind of guy. All right, uh, let's take this and uh, we can open. Hmm, am I gonna lose my keys if I do this? So they're in the door now. Alright, if I open this, that thing's gonna shoot me. Can I take the keys back? Why can't I take the keys back? I bet I could have used them. I wonder if I could have taken those keys into a different realm. Where are we now? Where do I need to go? Alright, jam this, that opens here, I need, a, I need two jammers. Can't get the gun from here, oh well, let's, let's open this. I guess I, is there any reason to put this back there? Is there anything back there? There's nothing back there, right? I spent much time waiting for the designer to take my hand until I realized that he had been guiding me all along. I realized that it isn't for me to seek his help, it's for me to help myself. I don't see anything else in there. Can we? Oh, I think I see what to do. Let's, uh, open this up. Let that thing out. Alright, now let's open this up. From where, though? What's a good place? Right here. Or right here. Come on out! Alright. Now... Um... Now go through there. And kill that guy! Yo, slowpoke. Go! Go, go, go! Haha! <laughs> I got the thing! And now I can go down here. And the gate is open. And... Let's see, is there any way to like take- throw- throw this thing out of the puzzle? Oh, maybe I maybe I can't take keys through the purple stuff. A ladder? Can I climb ladders? I can. Neat. Yeah. So this this slightly narrowed field of view is good for me. I think. Uh, still feeling a little nauseous. Alright, don't run into that. Okay, I, I can aim through here. Maybe, I wonder if there's anywhere I could take this, like, up high to aim out. Even if I can't use it out. It'd be worth thinking about. Take anything? No.
Alright, I got one. Let's move on. D puzzle. A bit tied up. Alright, that one's already being jammed. That one's being jammed. <laughs> All right, so I think what I need to do is I need to get these out. Order of operations. <laughs> Make sure that you get everything in the order you need to. All right, I'll put you here actually, so that just in case. There we go. Boom. Now those are dead, and there's nothing else to do here. So, I got three of these things now. That's a good amount. That's just the way out. Uh, open you. And... Jam you. Oh, there's another one. Um, so I think I want to take one of these through. Actually, I probably want to take both of them through. Let's just get all of them. Take all of them with us. So, now, jam that one. In fact, since we have three of these, we might just be able to to go indefinitely. Oh, hey. Ah! Well, I was thinking ahead. There's no ahead. First star! Alright, God, what do you have to say about this? Got an achievement. Sigils are not enough. God is saying nothing. Did that tree just move? I think the tree just moved. All right, got a star! Let's go to the next place. Stash for later. All right, I could take this one. I don't know if it will kill me if I take this, I just won't walk by. Take a look around. All right, we've got a, a door. Which leads to another one of those. Here's a place with going around. Hey, look, keys. That was easy. Put the keys in there. I can... Ah, no need. Um, what I gotta do... Hello, bomb. Oh, I gotta use this one to get the other one, probably. Yep. Now I got two of them. What's, where's the way? Not, where is it? Which way do I go? Around here, okay. There's a bomb coming this way. And it's coming by again. All right, now we can put this one here. Coming back. Now it's plenty of room. was a mistake. I'm just going by, just exploring. It's over here, just into this area. Alright. <laughs> uh, probably should have... I wonder if I can run past here. 
Wait, there's another one? Um, maybe these are just these two. Alright. I think I can walk out here, no problem, yep. Alright, I don't see any more secrets. No, more obvious secrets. So let's go. This is not the way. Go get this one again. Where are you? Coming this way. And here we go. Where are you? Nowhere in sight. Collect! And now a gate lowered. Alright. Making some progress today. I mean, other than the, the non-progress we made in World 4. What's left? This way. Looks like the last way. Locked me up, swallow the key. Not over here. Around here. One of these. Oops. Alright, so there's, there's a sound effect that's like... Ugh, not like that. It's like... And it sounds... It's kind of like um, the stars in Super Mario Galaxy make. And so I'm like, is there a star nearby when that sound effect plays? But I think it's just part of the music. Hey, the keys! Alright, open this. Get this through. Lock this up. Actually, there might be a... Yeah, this looks like the way I gotta go. Get another one. Which means I can do this. And I can do... Yeah, you think I'm gonna... Think I'm gonna leave one behind? Ha! And I just win. What? I didn't mean to jump down, I wanted to be up there. Oh no, I can't get back. I just wanted to be on top of the wall. Too bad, I guess. Well, we got all the things here. Now... Well, we missed a star. Hey look, it's another robot. Yet more evidence that this is a simulation. Although it could be something that I haven't thought of, like some kind of weird, um, philosophical thing that I haven't thought of. Alright, does this give us any hints on where the stars are? Not really. Oh, is there- is this another one? Have I not done all the things here? Your user profile has now been generated. Or, or is this a, a something new? Is it, is it? Didn't I use this terminal before or was it a different terminal? Downloading. User. Profile. Registering. Profile. I hope for more philosophical questions because I love those. Congratulations, your new user account has been registered. Would you like to see the details? Uh, yes. Profile privileges, basic account privileges only, and I'm gonna get upgraded by answering more philosophical questions. Yay! Due to outstanding notes on your account, and despite displaying many of the characteristics of being a person, you cannot be granted admin status at this time. In the meantime, please enjoy the basic account functionalities. That was this one. Um, display psychological profile. 
You may already be criticizing your own performance, but it's clear you understand how the world of ideas affects you, even if you are sometimes weary with the realities and allow your preferences to dictate your beliefs. You have a great deal of unused capacity, which you have not turned to your advantage. Disciplined and self-controlled outside, you tend to be worrisome and insecure inside, but you pride yourself as an independent thinker and do not accept others' statements without satisfactory proof. <laughs> oh, well, thank you, horoscope. You probably tell everybody that, don't you? Display conflicts. User provided an objective response when asked for a subjective one. User provided a particular account of personhood, but was uncomfortable with its implications. User sought to maximize both liberty and quality of life, but these ideals are incompatible. User denied moral authority, but defended moral claims. User had inconsistent ideas about value. Uh, yep, that, that, uh, that is a, a, <laughs> a rather a, a human thing. Wow, a lot of conflicts, but that's okay. Um, for one, we're being asked to choose from a, a list um, and and uh, asked to to give essentially yes or no answers, which uh, is not sufficiently complex enough to to uh, get at your full beliefs. You have to like write essays and stuff, and then even the essays you gotta like keep going and keep going to really dig down and find out what you think. Uh, but also, it's just human nature to take shortcuts and not have consistent beliefs. This is really cool, I like it. And I'm also of the opinion that a person does not need to have consistent beliefs. Uh, what else have I, uh, pre I've done these three. Access COM portal. You currently hold a basic account. Network access is restricted to administrators. Please enjoy the basic functionalities. All right. MLA support ticket. This is where I get to answer more questions. Or not. <laughs> Sorry I wasn't able to answer, assist you if you're still encountering a problem. Please describe it. Account certification error. Thank you. A support ticket has been generated and appended to your profile. You will receive a notification when a reply has been sent. Uh, I guess that's all I can say. Alright, so it looks like it was the same terminal. Okay, again, we'll come back and get all the stars. This one just has no text. Strange. Alright, we'll consider this one finished.